Hey guys, it's Corey from Fortnite News, and today we will be discussing the updates from March 12th and 13th. All links will be in the description. So, first off, we, I have a lot to say about the new Fortnite mobile game. You've probably seen the Fortnite mobile trailer, but if not, I'll just play it now. So you can now sign up for the waiting list, but be careful, because Fortnite tweeted a warning a few hours ago, saying we have not sent out any mobile invites yet, please be aware of false mobile download links. Our official URLs are Fortnite.com and EpicGames.com. But don't stare at your inbox, because the invites won't go out until later this week. If you are still confused about how to sign up, Fortnite made this. The link will also be in the description. The last thing about Fortnite Mobile is the first pictures of the UI layout or controls. I'm pretty sure that's a scope button, that's the sneak button, that's the jump button, that's the inventory button, but that's probably the fire button? I'm not sure because that just looks a bit weird. Uh, here's another picture. The controls will be very interesting because they look pretty hard to master. So for our next topic, we have some leaked images of new items coming to the game. We have remote explosives and the rarity will be rare. According to Epic Games, they toss an explosive charge out at a short range. The charge will explode if it takes any damage. Next, we have Stink Bombs, which will be an epic rarity. Stink Bombs hurl a grenade that unleashes a cloud of poison. Lastly, we have egg launchers, which Epic Games hasn't released any information on besides the name and the image. All three items that I spoke about today are totally confirmed. They are definitely coming to Fortnite soon. The last thing is the daily items, which are Make It Rain, Breaking Point, Wasp, Death Valley, Sash Surgeon, and Snorkel Ops. Thank you all for watching. If you did enjoy the video, consider hitting that like button. And uh, see y'all next time. Peace.